Okay, so for networking wheels too, setting up RPC events to control things is fairly straightforward. Right now we're looking at the server driving around and it's nice and smooth as it should be because there's no network involved. But if we switch to the client, this is I believe using the default Unreal Engine 4 network code and it's just a bit janky. The thing shakes around and generally it's pretty hard to drive even when you're going in a straight line it wobbles around madly and there probably are things I could tweak to make it work better but I'm not sure what they are so for now I've uh, done my own little net bit of network code it's fairly simple as far as these things go let's open up the blueprint okay it's a bit awful actually um, a, a good chunk of this isn't used, but basically, uh, as Ramar from the forum suggested, I had a force to all parts of my uh, system to push it into the direction of where it should be, comparing a synch synchronized transform and its actual transform, and I also lurk towards it as well, but only a little bit, so as not to, well, surprise it. Oh, though the main difference is the rotation. I break apart the rotator and make that much closer so your rotation is always similar to the of the server though the position can vary a bit and to see how this looks in game we can see it's synchronizing it swings around a bit into position I've left that there intentionally so we can see what happens when it's not synchronized but then driving is mostly smooth as butter even if I drive up to the server here it all looks good bump into the server and everyone's happy. I can even add a little bit of latency, 150, and it starts becoming a bit more noticeably incorrect and harder to drive, but it's still better than the default networking with no latency. Even in first person it's fairly smooth. I'm sure with a bit more tweaking and tidying this can get better yet. These rocks in the middle here are synchronised across the network, however these ragdolls aren't. So driving across those will cause a difference between the server and the client. And we should be able to see... Oh, yep, a bit of weirdness happening. 